Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve question number eight of exercise thirteen point five. The question says a solid cube of size twelve centimeter is cut into eight cubes of equal volume. What will be the side of the new cube? Also, find the ratio between their surface areas. So here we have a large cube. and this cube the edge of this cube is 12 me centimeters and this cube is cut into eight equal cubes you have to find the side of this new cube so obviously first of all we have to find the volume of this cube volume of bigger cube and the volume of a cube is a cube where a stands for its edge so a cube will be a multiplied by a multiplied by a so a multiplied three times and a for this cube is 12 so this will be the volume of the bigger cube now this bigger cube has been cut into eight equal parts which are equal in volume so obviously i have to if i have to find the volume of the smaller cube and because this for a uh, cube has been cut into eight pieces and all eight pieces are equal in their volume so the volume of the new cube will be volume of this cube divided by 8 so 4 2 times 4 Three times and two six times. So here it should be twelve into six is seventy-two multiplied by three. So this centimeter cube will be the volume of the smaller cube. Now I have to find the side of this smaller cube, and volume is equals to A cube and volume is given to me as seventy two multiplied by three and that is equal to A cube. Now if I have to find the value of A, then I have to find the cube root of seventy two multiplied by three. Now I have to factorize this and after the making of uh, I have to make the pair of three and I have to take one value out of every pair. So either multiplying these what i can do i can split these values right to here so 3 will remain as it is this is 6 so 6 6 can be written as 3 multiplied by 2 and 12 can be written as 4 multiplied by 3 and 4 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 <coughs> sorry now i have to make a pair of a group of 3 values or can say three multiples okay three factors so the first group of three factors is 3 so taking one common and the second is 2 so here the edge of this smaller cube should be 6 cm now in the second part i have to find the ratio of their surface areas so the surface area of the bigger cube and i have to find the ratio of surface area of the smaller cube and the formula to find out the surface area is 6 a square upon 6 a square the formula will remain the same but for the bigger cube side Uh, is capital A and the formula smaller it is small a. So six can be cancelled with six. A here is twelve multiplied by twelve, and small a is six multiplied by six. So this can be cancelled two times. Again, this can be cancelled two times. So the ratio between surface area of the bigger cube 
is to surface area of smaller cube is 4 is to 1 because 2 to multiply by 2 is 4 and the denominator it is 1 so ratio between these two cubes should be 4 is to 1 so this is how you can solve this particular one I hope you have understood this one if you like this video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths you can directly contact us the phone number the email address and the whatsapp number is given below in the description thank you